Hello, and welcome back to our channel. My name is Amelia and in today's episode of The After Show, we invite you to watch our top stories from all around the world. Female, she appears to be stabbed. She appears to be what? Stabbed? Stabbed? First, we present you our top 10 documentaries that filled our time during the 2020 pandemic. ...with a teenager and murder. What an easy sell to television. Later, our most listened songs during last year, according to YouTube Music app. You look really hot next to all those vitamins. And right away, two white girls remind us life when it wasn't strange and restrictive. Take a picture of me in front of these probiotics, please. Make sure the flax oil is definitely in the background. <laughs> Stay tuned for our top stories and many other surprises. really hot next to all those vitamins. It's like my two favorite things. It's like vitamins and Sarah. Hey, uh, can you take a picture of me in front of these probiotics, please? Make sure the soil is definitely Who is this? We don't have to turn this into an evening with Liza Manella. And that's how a girl makes a scene. Hello, and welcome to our channel. Here's a list of the most interesting documentaries that filled out our time during the 2020 pandemic. I saw him text her all the time but I didn't think that they had a relationship like that. I love you, now die. This two-part documentary about the texting suicide case that captured national interest raises difficult questions about technology, mental health, and whether or not one teenager can be held responsible for the suicide of another. I'm Dan Schneider, and I'm a pharmacist. I can almost remember every piece of my life. I have hundreds of hours from wiretapping phone conversations about what happened to me. The pharmacist, a small town pharmacist, stakes a mission to save his community. His main enemy is a different kind of drug dealer. But I was determined to get the killer off the street. And if the police wasn't going to do it, I was going to do it. Children who are really sick in a serious way. When I do the examination, I tell the parents that you are the ones who are suffering because of her condition. This is a way of protection. Life overtakes me. Filmmakers examine a mysterious illness called resignation syndrome. The illness causes traumatized children to retreat into a coma-like state. A 12-year-old female, she appears to be stabbed. She appears to be what? Stabbed? Stabbed? Wire and Geyser are accused of stabbing the friend and leaving her for dead. Police say the suspects were inspired by a character on a website. Beware of the Slenderman. Beware the Slenderman discusses the incident in which two girls attempted to murder one of their friends in an attempt to appease Slenderman, a fictional monster who originated from an internet phenomenon called Creepypasta. If we understood the world, and if we understood ourselves, that's worth everything. ESP Nexium is a methodology that allows people to optimize their behavior. 
The Vow. The Vow is an American true crime documentary and follows members who joined the cult Nexium. Its leader, Keith Rainier, was convicted of sex trafficking. Sex with a teenager and murder. What an easy sell to television. Captivated. The trial of Pamela Smart. The 1990 murder of Greg Smart is still a mystery. The subsequent trial of Mrs. Pamela Smart attracted a large media coverage. What we're doing here today is groundbreaking. You don't know Jack. The film features the efforts of former pathologist Jack Havorkian to help the terminally ill and the profoundly disabled end their lives. The outspoken Kevorkian becomes a polarizing figure, and he is often referred to in the press as Dr. Death. Do you consider yourself a patriot? The Spy, the miniseries follows the exploits of Eli Cohen, a Mossad spy who activated in Syria. He assumes a new identity and establishes himself in the Syrian high society. This series is an excellent choice for a cinema marathon. Our Godfather. This is the story of Tommaso Bichetta, the first mafia boss ever to turn against Cosa Nostra. Bichetta helped convict more than 400 mafiosi. He became the mob's most wanted man in the world. The disgraced financier Jeffrey Epstein is dead. Jeffrey Epstein, filthy rich. Survivors worldwide reveal the manipulation, abuse and emotional scars suffered at the hands of wealthy convicted pedophile Jeffrey Epstein. Their stories expose a sex trafficking ring of powerful enablers leading up to his 2019 arrest. Thank you for your time. We hope these titles were worthy of your interest. Also, we are eager to read all about your favorite movies in the comment section. Lately, 